So you guys have, it seems like recently, just sort of hit this, this like, yeah. uh, like massive inflection These last point. Like four or five months just totally shadow everything that comes before it. It makes it me feel kind of stupid going back and thinking how excited we were for the, you know, tens of thousands of users we were getting in our first few years, yeah. and now to look back and I mean, like, can you share some it. of the numbers of like what? I mean, the the really staggering one now is that we're growing by. Uh, a quarter million impressions every week. So that's the one where, or excuse oh. me, quarter billion, quarter billion impressions every week. So each week we're serving 250 million more impressions than we were the, the week prior. Oh, wow. Okay. Adding up to now, uh, we're doing, I think, like 1.2 billion impressions, 1.2 billion every week. Um, and that's something that we were. Wait, so you're going 1.2 billion this week, and then you'll actually go to 1.4 billion next week? That's right. So the okay. last 30 <laughs> days we've served, I think, 4. 4.2 billion impressions. And do you have do you have any explanation as to what? Do you think you just yeah some, we can like we can see it. Um, and we've always sort of followed this, and it's interesting to see how stuff sort of um, growth comes from all different places and different stages. And I would say our first year was very much about first adopters in the U.S. Our second year was when we started to see some real international traction. Um, their third year was all about I would say sort of mainstream U.S. growth. That's where we started to really take off in the U.S. Um, also September 2009. Part of what, what um, we attribute to the U.S. growth was September 2009. Um, college students, either starting college or going back to school for the first time, uh, started, started signing up for Tumblr in droves. And that was our first wave of younger users hmm. um, that we started to see uh, that school year. Um, but yeah, so it, it started to be real mainstream adoption in the U.S. This last year, and particularly the last six months, has been real uh, acceleration and growth in a few international countries. So yeah. Europe has taken off all of a sudden. Japan, which we had a lot of traction in early, all of a sudden is one of our fastest growing countries again. Brazil sort of showed up all at once in the last four months. Hmm. Um, and yeah, you can really, it, it's mostly you know, geographic. It's mostly uh, one, one particular country is either starting to check out Tumblr for the first time or showing up all at once. And so your impressions will grow like 20% in a week, <laughs> basically what you're saying. I mean, like, how do you, how in the world do you, uh, are you just like, I mean, you just raise money. I assume yeah. you're just like buying servers, like. It, it was largely it, for that, and, and that was one of the things that made us more comfortable with, with raising more money. Well, you uh, had to probably to just keep the thing going, right? I mean. Yes. Um, so, uh, well, let's see. So, so the, um, the infrastructure stuff is frankly something we were just unprepared for. So if you look at all of our growth today, I don't know, I mean, I don't know how you could prepare for that. But, yeah. um, we, we were, I think, uh, we should have had more servers. We should have had more operations people. We're, we're making up for that now, and our, our current team is doing an extraordinary job. Um, but yeah, really, if you look at you know, our traffic over the last three months, it just totally shadows everything that came before it. And we've been you know, behind the curve and just rushing to catch up with that. But yeah, yeah we'll get there, and we'll, uh, I think, be able to scale much further than we have so far. So.